I got my excuse my beauty package. Hello, by Miss Antoniqua herself, Miss Antoniqua Brown. It says beauty, but on the butt it says babe. Her is me. I like her. Very cute, very cute. Hey y'all, what's up? Hold on, it's shaking cause I got my thing sitting on the bed and I'm moving the bed. Hey y'all, what's up? It's your girl Zoe and I'm back once again with another mother video. <laughs> I'm going to be filming today. Hey guys, I have so much going on in my crazy, crazy life. Like, I be feeling like I be having so much stuff going on, but it's really not a whole lot of stuff going on. It's like the same stuff, but just, you know, like still a lot. But if y'all haven't noticed, let me show you my hair. I look a freaking mess. Like, I honestly look a whole mess. And my hair was up like this with this down. You yeah, know, I'm gonna wash my hair out today and do like probably like a slick back with my regular curls. Oh, that feels so great. It's my scalp. I know I look crazy. In today's video, I'm going to focus on getting myself together. I will be washing this straight hair out of my head and I wanna put my little cluster lashes on. I also need to go to the store and get some wax. I started doing my own like Brazilian, my own waxes, so I'm really into that right now. And I'm gonna get myself together and I'm gonna let y'all watch because getting yourself together just makes you feel good. It just makes you feel so good as a person. Lately, my mental health has been like, deteriorating i'm not even gonna lie this is definitely um seasonal depression season you know and i know we're all like talking about it on social media and stuff and no it's here this is this is what it is for me i feel like it really really hits in the fall i never would ever associate myself with having seasonal depression i really do have seasonal depression and even the fact that i'm in school like school gives me depression period so the fact that it's just the season is changing it it's all it just makes sense you know today is friday um, by the time y'all probably see this, it'll be around Thanksgiving because I plan on editing this next week. But also, y'all, guess what came in the mail for me yesterday? <laughs> I got my Excuse My Beauty package. Hello. By Miss Antoniqua herself. Miss Antoniqua Brown. I want to give you guys an actual thorough, kind of like a reaction video, I guess, to my merch or to her merch that I bought. Like, is it worth it? What's it doing? Because you know that that little set, I ain't gonna lie, Miss Brown. That little set was a pretty penny. But I understand that I don't understand everything that goes into being like a business owner or an entrepreneur, like selling your own merch. Like this is your this is your label. Like I, I get it. It's pricey. That's why I had to, you know, show my love. And anybody that know me know I love me some of Miss Antonica. I gotta stop saying that. Neek. Is who I'm talking about. Excuse my beauty. Neat. That is who I'm talking about. So when my package came yesterday, I had, you know, posted it on my story or whatever. And I did make it cute and I tagged her. But you know, sometimes like with shit, the word just lost me. Like public figures or not like, but you know, like social media influencers. Like, I don't always be thinking that they will like repost my thing. So I'm like, yeah, if they repost, they do. If not, you know, it is what it is. Try again another day. But y'all, y'all see they... Y'all see the, let me back up, let me back up. I know y'all see that, where she at? Look, excuse my beauty. And she reacted to my story. She gave me a little hard eyes or whatever. I was feeling a little pressed, I'm not even gonna lie. You know how people be like, oh, XX, XYZ, repost me, da, da, da. You know, I ain't wanna seem like one of them, but baby, I was pressed, I'm not gonna lie. I can say it now because you know, it's old. Yeah, that was nice. And then she also shared it on her story and I was like, oh. But yeah, I cannot wait to try this on. I'm gonna give y'all my real 
reaction. I don't know if I'm gonna wear it to breakfast or if I'm going to wait because I'm also trying to film another video later today just talking about like all the different hairstyles that I've been doing since I combed out my locks. I've been getting a lot of people like requesting or like just asking me like like under that video like my 10 things I wish I knew before coming on my locks that video especially like a lot of people have been asking what kind of hairstyles can you do damn like I really don't have a video about this and I've been wanting to make one fingers crossed I will have two videos uploaded by next week so stay tuned and just a really quick update I'm gonna fill y'all in real quick because it's almost been 10 minutes and I just been sitting here I am currently in my senior year of college if y'all watched my last video, y'all already know that. I went around to school and stuff. Good video. Make sure I go check it out. I am four classes away from my bachelor's degree. And it feels so good to say that because, bitch, it's been a motherfucking stroll. Okay, let me tell you. It has been rough. I literally had a couple mental breakdowns, which is not bad because, you know, they come, they come and go. But yeah i have homework all the time i have assignments all the time i'm always meeting with this group that group doing a project doing a pre like i'm doing so much not to mention i also work part-time i work from home my desk is over there i work at a call center i have a lot going on honestly lately i just have not been feeling myself i've just been feeling like bitch what are you doing like i'm too young to be like this and i just cannot wait till i graduate that way i can make my youtube videos and work my full-time job yep it's gonna be a nine to five but that's okay because i'm gonna be doing youtube on the side school honestly does not make me happy i will say this right now and then i'm gonna leave it with this if you are somebody who is going into college or you are in college like your first year or whatever college is not for everybody okay granted i made it i'm almost at the end and all that stuff but it is not for everybody it is not for the week like i always say this about me i don't do well under pressure like under pressure like i be i be messing up under pressure so don't feel like you have to push your way through college if that's not truly what your heart desires it is a lot okay and if i wasn't four classes away from my degree i probably would take a break but i'm too close to the finish line to stop now so can't even think about that so I am currently in the kitchen right now. My hair has been straight for like two weeks now. Yes, I washed my hair in the kitchen sink. Click off if you don't like that. I'm sorry if you think it's nasty. I really, I can't wash my hair in the shower. I should have never took you to the Louis V store. Shopping sprees on Rodeo. Eat steak and shrimp at Pearlman. King crab legs at Papa Dos. All I ever asked was, can you not blow up my phone and dial me in my zone? All I ever asked was, can you just keep it real? Sit home and chill. We never used to have an issue. Fly to the A. Hold up, run and dive all night. Two or three drinks a kid. That's right. Hold my knee, cause you can be my wife. So it's been about two hours. I need to do my eyebrows since I gelled my hair down and everything. Sleek. Look at the fuck. So this is how it's looking. I need to get some extra hair to add to my bun. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you putting your hat on? Sis. Uh, because my hair is like what? Or... Damn, yo. My freaking microphone stand broke. I'm so freaking mad about it. I can't even talk about it. I'm so mad about it. Yo, that's my sis in the back. Say what's up, sis. What's good? Like, I gotta go to the grocery store so I can go and get the food to cook the sliders and the chicken fingers and the fries. All right, so if y'all can't already tell, I have no idea where this vlog is going. I did get to go to Sally's. I did get my wax, because I'm gonna be giving myself a wax between today and tomorrow, probably tomorrow. Well, I just came from the grocery store. My fiance, my boo, he asked me if I could cook for him tonight. He said that he wanted some uh, chicken fingers and fries, like, but homemade, like he wanted me to fry the chicken fingers and fry the fries, of course. And I was like, well, chicken fingers and fries, why don't we add like some sliders or like some burgers? I have two brothers here right now. So I figured I'm just gonna make sliders and chicken fingers for the whole house. There he go, putting me to work once again. But that's gonna be like a really quick, easy meal, like sliders, chicken fingers and fries, like everything is going to get fried. Plus I really only have like two hours to really make everything because I'm supposed to be going to my cousin's. She's been on my channel before. Her name is Darnay Scott. She is performing tonight and I'm supposed to be going to see her perform. 
So this is like the perfect, easy, really quick meal to just throw together real quick and keep it moving. And everybody swears I'm always being so dramatic when I say my life is crazy. No, it really is nuts. Like if you text me and I don't respond, it's not because I don't want to. I'm just so busy all the time. And I still have a homework assignment that's due tonight by 12 o'clock. So we're gonna see how this goes. I'm done cooking. It's been crazy, now we gotta go. But here's my food. It is currently the next day. I didn't even finish out the vlog yesterday. I feel like I showed y'all my food and then that was it. But right now I'm about to do my lashes with these Kiss Ever Easy lashes. They're the trio ones. I'm just gonna use the rest of this pack and then this pack as well. I did do a video earlier, like a long, long, long time ago on my channel of me doing my lashes from home. I have touched on it before. I do not like getting lash extensions because I don't like always, oh, hold on, wait, it's not focused. Are we gonna focus? Okay, here we go. I don't like getting lash extensions because I feel like I don't like not being able to take something off my eyelashes easily if I don't want it there anymore. My eyes are very sensitive. So I feel like what works for me is just having some, um, like the clusters, I just do them from home. And then I can take them off whenever I want, put them on whenever I want. Like I like to be able to rub my eye, itch my eye. When I had the extensions before, like the lashes just kept on going in my eyeball. And I think it's because my eyelashes are really short and curly. They're not really an easy type of eyelash to do lash extensions on. So I'm very hesitant about getting my eyelashes done. But recently I have been thinking about going back to getting them done. My lash tech goes to a eyelash person that I really like because her lashes always look so good. But I just told her like, I'm so nervous. My lashes don't do well when I get lash extensions. I don't even wanna have to put myself through that if I don't have to. This is the lash glue that I'm using. I normally don't use this lash glue. I normally use the white with the pink writing on it by Duo, but I they didn't have the at Sally, so I had to get this guy. So yeah, I'm gonna do my lashes. Y'all probably, if y'all can see me, I'ma just speed it up. Because like I said, I've already done this before on my channel, so if y'all really wanna see like how I do it, Y'all can just go back and look at that video, to be honest. I normally always do it on the bottom, but the bottoms have been getting on my nerves, so. all right so this is what the eye looks like after just doing like one layer on the top so this is what it looks like i just have the mediums and then the short so i have to go take my brother to the mall but when i get back i'm gonna finish and i'm probably gonna put another one on top that way it's just more full so y'all see now i am finally done i'm doing my lashes with the clusters so i did go in with the clusters and then i also put some of these on there i got them off of amazon they are the um 20d extension salon quality and result j curl yeah these are them i could put a link in the description box down below if somebody really really wants to know right off of amazon girl okay shit don't make me do all that extra work if i don't have to yeah, so this is what the lashes look like after i feel like they're really really cute um there are a few things i would have done a little bit different i feel like it's a little choppy over here ain't gonna lie because i had to trim it just a little bit but for the most part, I like them. I probably won't leave them on no longer than like two to three days probably because like I said, I just really don't care to leave my lashes on that long. So now it is finally time. I'm going to show you guys my, excuse my beauty, my merch that I got from Neek excuse my beauty on ig of course y'all have to know her like if you don't know her i don't i don't know what to tell you like you have to know her i only got one beige or like nude or beige color i guess matching set from her so 
the top was $65 and the bottoms were $65. I got a size medium. All in all, the final total came to $147. And 80 cents that's including the shipping and the tax so shipping was ten dollars and then the tax was like seven so yeah all right y'all so i have the entire set on i actually really really love this i was a little bit worried just because i know sometimes like ordering matching sets like you know how the pants don't fit all the way or don't cut like a little too high up on the ankle so i was a little bit nervous but i have my fingers crossed and honey i really like this i feel like it's definitely good material and i saw her say that on like her i think like her last video that she did when she was talking like her inventory room and stuff so i see that it is really Really good material um, I don't have as much worry about when I put it in the washer and dryer that it will shrink it's very cozy it's very soft I like how on the top you can see it I'm gonna wait till it gets a little darker it says beauty but on the butt it says babe so if you can see like the bottoms you see how it cuts off like literally at the ankle. I don't mind when my sweatpants come down to my ankle. I feel like it's actually kind of cute because you can see like my ankle bracelet. But like I was saying, I love the bedazzlement that's on the top and the butt. I think that is really, really super cute. I would shop again, I would. I think I would get the black set. The only reason I went with this set is because I felt like hella people were gonna go with the black because you can literally wear black with any and everything. And I have so many black two-piece sets already from my Fashion Nova hauls. Go check that out because you know, I got a couple. But yeah, like I really like this. It's silver, it goes with my rings and my jewelry. I just, I really like this. Now I will say one thing that I am a little bit worried about, like little, 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 little. The bedazzlement, although it's so cute, y'all. I'm just nervous that it's gonna come off when I wash it. Like, I have another set that I bought from a friend, and like, you know, she had her own business or whatever, and my bedazzles came off my pants, y'all. I was so upset, I was in class, and they were just falling, falling off. So I really hope the bedazzlement does not come off of my top or the bottoms like i hope whatever is adhesing the the bedazzles to the shirt stays on but other than that like it's just i really do like this set it's very very good quality i definitely think you should go ahead and purchase you can go to her instagram excuse my beauty or you can go to her website i'll put it in the you know i'll put it in the description I'm pretty sure anybody that watches this video though probably already knows me but yeah so y'all definitely should go check her out you know but yeah i'm about to take a couple of selfies and my cute little uh matching set is definitely it's cute vibes i mean i could even like i got some money in here y'all see my little purse or whatever mm. i definitely like what i bought but yeah i like her her is me i like her very cute, very cute. But I did want to show you guys because I said that I was going to be getting some wax and everything like that from Sally's and I did. This is the hard wax that I got from Sally's. I will be probably waxing myself tonight. If y'all want to see a separate video of like my reaction to waxing myself or whatever, let me know in the comments down below. I think it will be super cool and super funny. So that's it you guys. Don't forget to follow me on all of my socials. I love you. I love you. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I love you guys. Thanks so much for watching. And I'm more for something carefree Power drink, have a seat next to me